seven cities, those legions of angels, shave off the night and ask a question of today's seal on the rock. The instrument out playing, what avoids reproach from itself, tow wheel, and by play I meant sex, and by sex I meant work, the first being duty, the first thing you ever did when you woke up this morning and sat on the rock, what news do you have today? The news of the rock, the book of us Macadrums, seals in the daytime, under the sun of the other, and Macadrums are like a clan of people, and they had they had webbed fingers, so they were thought to be seals. Mm -hmm. Two, who sits on the rock speaks the book of the rock. Menelaus forgets he isn't a bull walrus, and his sea wife drags him home with her. The kind of sense that survives the beautiful lies of Prote and everything, until you're no place, holding something soft and warm. Flesh is intelligent on the other side of the airtight lock. Open it with a breath. This is the will of the world. Three. I rub my hands, a numbness in my left pinky and ring finger, but of course they're all ring fingers this cool September morning. The wife and kids still on the other side of my dream. There's an apartment on Nostrand and President in some totally other configuration, like lighthouses come down to the sea, such mysterious ambassadors. What light casts its shadow on my fingers? What rock chose them? Like your grandmother at the end of the world at Brighton Beach sitting on the jetty pearls like they used to, her silver hair round mirror earrings. If we knew what we were looking for, we might know why. It's the personal business of the person. Yell out what you see and hope for the best. Synapses in the mass psychology of God having the crazy epiphany of everything else. What's it got to do with anything besides being continually thought? The Bible's the only book we know how to write. My finger stones begin to tingle as I walk past PS 316, and lo, these are my wives, these are my children, only they don't know it. Four, I misread Tesht for Fesh Trip. Body in the Majar, flesh of the world. It's hard to eat anything when you're young, when you succumb to youngness, forgetfulness, the second nature, the unknown work, because we never stop eating to bury the secret book in your body. It's food that's new, like cell phones and skydiving. We've been doing it all along. Five. The book of celestial man. I mean as she was, not too much in, not too much out. The mesocosm, somewhere between universal and man, the fold between no image of the world and an image, where the tarot is real enough you might recognize me. Everyone's a messenger. The carrier pigeons used to black out the sky used to be us, carried ourselves, our obscenity. You can kill an image without even aiming, he said from the shadow where a feather had been. But we are armed against this. I am an earless seal, my song not from the throat, but the mind, spurts of Elmer's glue. Why should I explain my song? The shadows are not about telling. Unassimilable, get us and strut away, plainmen, highwaymen, rogue images. I am the breathing rock of the plane of their existence, a rock in the flagellant's shoe when he can no longer feel me. It's a heresy, but compassion needs those nouns, the shipping container of your life, its endless spill in the tidal river of us. Only the precision of the piece of petrified wood on my desk, a naughtiness in the phrasal keeps the world stapled together. The sin is to reduce it to us, yet there is no it without us. Go ahead, sin. Seven, the heaving world in us oxen. There are wheelbarrows and sturdy, sly smiles. Cowgirls, a cow people, that is what we are, isn't it? Behind the evanescent froth of my snorts. Near enough to wreck on, no doubt. The world wrecked up on the world as soon as you feel it there. A drunken sailor chasing star, rock, seal, in the great well of first absence remembered like water remembers water. It was all true. I confess, every lie I threw out came back as a cute neighbor, looking for sugar, mistrustful of me, thinking of pie. All the lives I've forgotten, but this one body dissolving reign of the names of things. Time is a sacred nonsense. The poem is what takes a day to write. The form takes on its newest failings, new demands, for light, trees, the newest growth, 
bathed in the murky restaurant of time's hip pocket, peers wistfully over the ridge, bridge of my glasses, not knowing what's there but the insistent geometry, or is it hydrometry, that fancy word for following your walking stick, leads us with the peculiar regularity of spectral babble and is its exegesis. Happy birthday. <laughs>